Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how I make Dunkin' Donuts matcha lattes. You hear that sound? That is the microwave in the back because I had to warm up my water because you are going to need like some hot water. But anyways, Dunkin' Donuts matcha latte is so fire. I'm telling y'all it's fire. It's something that you will be craving. So I thought to myself, I want to try to make that myself. Normally, that's what I do every time I taste something, you know, nine times out of ten, you can make that at home. So, that's what we're going to do. We're going to make our own Dunkin' Donuts matcha latte. And when I tell you when you make this, you're going to think that you went and got it there yourself. Yes, it's going to be fire. Yes, fire. So stay tuned to watch, and we're going to make our own matcha latte, and you won't have to go back to Dunkin' Donuts and spend another dime there just on your products that you're going to need. All right, so let's get this started. All right, y'all. So the things you're going to need are a blender. You're going to need some matcha green tea. I purchased this at Walmart. It is good. You get seven packets, and it's about like six seven dollars almost eight dollars i believe but sure it's well worth it for me when you get basically paying like a dollar for each packet but this is what the packets look like you're going to need one of these you're going to need you some hot water and it's one fourth of hot water in here so that's how much you're going to need you're also going to need some ice some sugar and some almond milk so that's pretty much all you're going to need for making this matcha latte so let's get this started we are going to be making some frozen matcha lattes so let's start making it all right first thing i'm going to do i'm going to take this packet and i am going to empty it into here So you just want to empty all the contents and shake it a little bit make sure you get everything out of there all right and then I am going to take this little whisker and I'm just going to Blend that up some. What you want to do is you want to blend that in as much as you can. So that's what we're going to do until all of it is dissolved. And you can tell on the bottom what is dissolved and what isn't. You don't want to take out the out the time to keep doing this. You can't get a spoon and do it, but I'm gonna do this for a little bit. But anyway, you're gonna mix this up until everything is dissolved. So we can just mix that up. that up with our hot water you can do it like hot or warm whichever one you prefer I'm trying to get everything in there so we can make sure it's all mixed good and ready we're just gonna mix that up so now that this has dissolved what we're going to do is i'm just going to pour this into this little dunkin donuts cup we really going to act like this is dunkin donuts so we got our cup ready just a half cup so with the half cup you're just going to mix this in with it like that and then we're just going to mix that up
gonna add our ice. You want like a cup of ice or however much ice you prefer. You just wanna add your ice up in there. And then you can pour however much sugar you want in here. I'll say like a tablespoon. It depends on how sweet you want your stuff. So normally I just eyeball stuff. Fire guys tastes just like it. I promise. I promise you. Got our frozen matcha latte from Duck and Donuts.